Hello YouTube from the Turbo Cave. I have here a Garrett T3 housing from I believe it's Cosport or something. But yeah, it's for a friend and it needs a new turbo uh, turbine housing and a new compressor wheel. And my machine doesn't have graphics to verify what I have wrote in the program. I'm programming this manually because I don't have a CAD CAD drawing of the part and it's much more faster to do it manually. So, but yeah, I'm going to modify the radius on the compressor housing and I wanted to check my program that it it is doing what I want it to do. So I took the cutter off and I inserted a pen into the cross slide, like so. Just clamp it on a slide and put a piece of cardboard on the on the ways. So there's my graphics overview of the of the radius it's gonna cut. But yeah, there was just something that I have done sometimes in the past because if I wasn't 100% sure and there's a chance I'm going to F up the part so I wanted to check the radius is good, it's going the right direction and the contour looks perfect so anyways this is just some small tip that you can do with these controllers or any CNC controllers if you don't have if you don't have the graphic interface that shows you the toolpath on the machine. But yeah, this is my toolpath generator. Looks okay. I'm gonna run it and test it and that's all for this video. Take care. Bye.